Hi everybody, this is Joe with the Technology Closet, and today I'm going to show you how to boot into the recovery partition on an OS X uh, Mountain Lion or Lion installation. The recovery partition is a 650 megabyte hidden partition that's installed when you uh, do the installation or upgrade to Lion or Mountain Lion on your Mac. Um, it it's, contains just enough files to boot into and a few utilities to either start off a new installation uh, of OS X or uh, it has disk utility in there so you can actually go in and um, partition drives and, and format them and uh, perform uh, um, uh, repairs on them for as, as far as the permissions go and everything. Um, you will find occasion where you might need to boot into this. Um, and it's just it's helpful to know how to do it. The key sequence that you want to do when you reboot the machine is the command key, hold that down, which is right next to the spacebar, and the letter R. That will boot into uh, recovery mode once the system starts rebooting. Um, the other option you have is if you hold down the option key while it's rebooting, uh, it will boot you into a, uh, a chooser menu where you can choose the disk that you want to boot off of and recovery drive will be one of them. Uh, this is going to be a little tricky as far as timing is concerned on a um, on a virtual machine and uh, there we go. I had to fire it off for some reason. It wouldn't bring up my menu bar. Uh, it's going to be a little tricky on a virtual machine because um, it's it's there's not a whole lot of time for me to to uh, reput the to recapture the focus of my mouse into the uh, into the VM as it's rebooting. So we're going to give it a shot here. We're going to go ahead and start, and we're going to do restart and restart, and we're holding down Command R as it's rebooting, and hopefully this will hopefully I caught it in time. And we'll see. There are ways in VMware Fusion that I can go in and change the timing so that I have more time to to get into there. But it looks like I got it. There we go. Okay, good. We're into the recovery partition. This is what you will boot into. This is actually what it will look like if you boot it off of uh, the USB thumb drive you created with uh, Apple's uh, recovery drive assistant. Um, and if you also if you boot off of the uh, USB thumb drive that you create you can create with Lion uh, Disk Utility or Lion Disk Maker I'm sorry um, and you can do a lot of stuff from here you can restore from uh, from a time machine backup so if you put a new hard drive in boot into this or um, um, you re reinstalled the OS 10 and you have a backup, a time machine backup of all your files. You can go in here and, and do the actual restore. Uh, you can actually do a restore from time machine backup of the entire operating system if you want because time machine by default will back up the entire OS. Um, we can do a reinstall of, um, of OS 10 directly. And again, this is going to go out on the internet and download the latest and greatest copy of the installation files and it can take some time so we're not going to go ahead and do that you can actually go online and with Safari in this just boot it off of this uh, simple partition uh, and surf and you can go to uh, Apple support sites and you know look up things and uh, it's, it's pretty handy uh, if your system won't boot and you can actually go into disk utility if we go into disk utility it's just like in the running system you have access to all your drives and this is where you would come in to uh, uh, go in and actually verify or repair permissions or verify disk or repair disk on your operating system drive if you're having difficulties of one sort or another uh, this is the actual um, main reason to boot into the recovery partition in, in my mind uh, if you're going to do a reinstall uh, like I said I have a usually usually have a USB thumb drive with all the files necessary to do the installation uh, and it's a little bit quicker. So to get out of it, you just quit this here, and you can go up to OS 10 Utilities, and you can quit the utilities. Okay, it's going to prompt you. You can either restart, uh, or you can choose a startup disk. I would like to choose a startup disk at this point, and this will show me any bootable disks that are attached to my system right now. I only have one, Macintosh HD, 
select that and hit restart and it will restart and bring me back up into my running OS 10 installation in a moment or two there we go and it's restarting and uh, just remember again it's it's for it's there for emergency but if you ever lose the entire hard drive in your system um, you need to have some other means to boot the machine and that's why we recommend the USB thumb drive in fact they're so inexpensive make multiple copies uh, because they they too can go bad and then you're you're stuck without a bootable uh, disk okay I'm gonna ignore this so excuse me so that is um, booting into the recovery partition on OS 10 mountain line thanks again for watching